So it's turning unicorn and I have kind of a disappointing update. So I had that wonderful threesome on Thursday, whatever, and like put a video out talking about how great it was. We all had this great time, everything, everything, everything. And, and they're no more. So they broke up. Um, I, it wasn't necessarily because of me, apparently, um, it was more of a lifestyle uh, compatibility issue or something with another couple. I, I don't know. Um, but I, I don't know. Um, so anyways, that couple's no more. So it will, won't be the three of us again. So it is what it is. I appreciate being told uh, the situation so that I didn't sit around waiting for some kind of text message that wasn't coming. Uh, so I appreciated that for sure. Um, but to be honest, uh, what do I think about that? It's like, you know, you finally like, find these people like you have good sexual chemistry and energy and everyone's pussy's pretty and everyone's dick's pretty and like and everything goes well and people laugh and people enjoy themselves and then and then they go home and then you're supposed to come and do it again and then they don't come and do it again and it's like i just sometimes i wonder like why like such such lucky rare dynamics are so short like it is the first couple i've ever slept with twice and that says a lot because I've tried to sleep with another couple again and they broke up too afterwards. Different reasons, ex came back. The ex is always fucking come back. Um, yeah, so it, it, it is what it is, but I think in, in, in this poly dynamic that, that, I, that these people were practicing in, like it, I just didn't think that there would be um, any sort of issue with sharing, um, sharing him. So I, I hope, I, apparently maybe there was, she got, uncomfortable or something with something that happened I don't know all I know is she did abruptly want to leave right after it was over she said she wasn't feeling well and, and to be honest like it, she, it could have been legit right but now looking back I'm like well <laughs> she also just like doesn't like you know I, I think she was doing it for him and I think that she genuinely thought it would make her happy to do it for him and then maybe she had maybe she had feelings that she didn't expect to have that weren't pleasant or something I don't know um, but it is, it is what it is. It's over for sure. And, uh, I said, you know, to, to, to be that, you know, who knows where life brings us, but like, I'm open to group sex. I'm open to threesomes. If you find more hot women, let me know. But like, but nothing else other than that. Right. Cause it's really, that's, that's, that's where we'll thrive. <laughs> uh, our dynamic is, is that. And I think that that's what I really like about, about it is, you you know people still have value to to one another even if they don't fit into their life in a certain way you know what i mean it's like well we could still fulfill each other's fantasies we could still be the reliable you know cock pussy in the room to have, you know know things are going to go a certain way so so we'll see what the future brings but i'm not waiting for anybody i am literally going to start looking for new couples i am interested in couples and and single men mostly um, so yeah, I'm excited and I uh, can't wait. I got vaccinated, number one. Um, as soon as number two comes, like I might still wear my mask, but I am definitely going to get fucked more. Um, fuck COVID. <laughs> so anyways, that's my update. It's, uh, it's going to be, uh, you know, back to starting one. So whatever.